Alright guys, I want to make a video showing you how to set up the Herpstat 1. So, uh, on the main display what you see is the temperature that's being read by the probe. This is the set point temperature and this is the power output from the Herpstat to your heating element. So to go to the menu you press this enter button and we'll start at output configuration and go to output mode. This will uh, allow you to choose the option by which you uh, heat so we can use dimming or pulse. I'm going to use pulse. Next we can select the daytime temperature and we can increase or decrease to the value that we wish to operate at. We can also implement a night drop option. <clears throat> so right now night drop is enabled. We can also set the nighttime temperature. And one of the fun things about the Herpstat is that it has a built-in internal clock, so we can also set start and end times for the night cycle. So let's take a look at how we do that. Uh, so the plus button will actually increase the hours. And so let's get that back to 8. And the minus button will increase the minutes in 15 minute increments. So we can do the same thing for the end time. And so, there, as you can see, I'm cycling through a lot of options that I can play around with. That's one of the things I like about the Herpstat. It gives you a lot of flexibility. So now that we've set up everything, we can just exit. And the Herpstat's ready to run. So there you go, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you'd like, I can make a more in-depth video going through all those options. Anyways, thanks for watching. Have a good day.